Rabbi Akiva was 40 years old and couldn't even read Hebrew or learn Torah. He was sitting next to a rock one day and he saw a hole in that rock. He looked up and noticed there was water dripping on the rock. It was that water dripping on the rock, drop after drop after drop, that actually bore a hole in the rock. He said to himself, if water, which is soft, can penetrate a rock that is hard, how much more so can Torah, which is like fire, penetrate my heart, which is soft. And he decided right there and then that he was going to dedicate the rest of his life to studying Torah. And he became one of the greatest sages that ever lived. The Torah goes on its way to describe that in the Mishkan, the tabernacle, they did everything the same way. Every step of the service was done in the same way, day in and day out. We learn such a huge lesson here. If I want to accomplish something important in life, I need to do it in a way that's consistent and continuous. Which drop made that hole in the rock? The process began at the very beginning with that very first drop of water. It was in that drop that the process of creating the hole began but it required to drop in the same place over and over and over again. Real growth requires asking yourself, what's my goal and how can I accomplish that in a way that is consistent and continuous? If we work on ourselves in a consistent way, in a way where we're putting one step in front of the other, we can create real change and real growth.